freedom. We'll risk it and now war. He's coming. For the surface world. You're watching Black Tree on TV. Um, I saw the movie last night. The best compliment I can really give it is it felt like a hug, you know? Mm. Like it was really needed. Um, I laughed, I cried a lot, obviously. Um, mm -hmm. Truly amazing. Keep that whole um, thing. But one thing I absolutely did love about this film, though, is without giving it away, um, there is a incredible fight scene on the bridge. I think it's one of the best fight scenes in the MCU. What was the training like for that? Intense. You know, at some point I'm gonna release a few of my the the training videos yeah. because everyone keeps asking me that, and a part of my training process is always to record okay. um, every single rehearsal. And I go home and I go over it by myself and study it. Like you have to study it like yeah. an exam. Like right, and okay. then the, the day of shooting is the day of taking the exam. Right. Um, and then also for my trainer, um, my trainer was of course in New York, I, we, of course we were not shooting there, so I would send her those videos oh. and she would break down the fight in terms of how I keep my form and, and you know, keep myself from messing up myself yeah. up forever or, or at least for the time of the, you know, just keep great form for my, you know, especially my shoulder, which right. is hard at work. So, uh, you know, it, it, was, um, it was very intense. I did... I went through a phase where I really got frenzied with training all like so much that my sh I did sort of mess up my shoulder for a oh, while. Wow. Okay. Um, and then I had to, I realized my form was was um, uh, not helping, so I had to relearn form. To so it was a process. Yeah, it sounds like yeah. um, And I was keen to start learning it because I read it on the page. I said, "Oh Lord!" I said, "Please give me this right away." And yeah. you know, uh, I wanted I wanted the choreography right away because I wanted you want to be able to forget on the right. day about anything but just being the character. You don't want to be thinking about mm -hmm. how what the next thing is. You want to be responding and strategizing and tactically like the character. And that requires a lot of rehearsal. And I so it like, was yeah. a lot of training. I love the team. Shout out to them. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, Micah, my trainer in both movies, incredible, incredible young man. Um, and of course, uh, the rest of the astounding stunt and fight team. And then also, um, shout out to the PT, okay, yeah, yeah, <laughs> to Neurosport, because yeah, yeah. they kept us all, uh, you know, you know, moving and grooving, you know, in a way that wouldn't, we wouldn't lock ourselves up and mess right. it up, you know, that shot, we shot over three nights, um, three nights uh, out in the cold, very, very cold, it's in the 20s. Um, okay, yeah, that's <laughs> a, <laughs> it was no Sounds joke. intense, yeah, yeah. And then we shot another night because uh, we didn't finish that and we had to go on break. Shot another night uh, and suddenly they'd figured out how to do it indoors. I was like, yeah. really? Oh, <laughs> after the fact, yeah. After the three nights of the 28 right. degrees. But, uh, you know, I'm thankful to hear it. It, 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 it paid off because it was a lot of work. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to yeah. sugarcoat it. It was a lot of work. <laughs> Better. Our foremothers gave us this beer because it is precise, elegant, and deadly. It will not change under my watch. Yes, General. I told you not to bring them. And it, it came out beautifully, so yeah. Thank um, you. Ryan Coogler is one of my favorite directors. Um, he's amazing. What's it? What's it like working with him compared to other directors? Um, you know, I I am um, I don't know if it's notorious or or uh, just basic, but I'm very very uh, picky. Okay. Like because I'm a writer as well, sometimes yeah. I'm like I'll just write. If I don't feel something, I, yeah. I won't go into it. The reason why I really wanted to be a part of this was because of, was largely because of him. Um, you know, when he when I heard that he was the director. Yeah. Uh, I was like, whoa, what? And they and they just said, you know, he he has never seen The Walking Dead. He's only seen okay. um, he saw you in Mother of George, which was this little indie yeah. that was going mm -hmm. on at the same time as Fruitvale and Sundance. And you know, just his 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 taste and his aesthetic. When I met him, I said, I, you know, I, I don't I don't know you, but I'm proud of you because I'd always oh. just been proud of him. You know, um, so young and accomplishing so much with such taste and elegance and restraint. Yeah but specificity and power. So um, he, as a director, he's, he's all those things. You can trust his taste. 
but you can also collaborate with him. You can you can push back, and yeah. uh, and he receives that, um, and he trusts he trusts your instincts as well. Like he really really does. You can get in front of the camera and speak and mm. do something and. He'll be like, all right, all right, let's do it again. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Like you can, he, great, he yeah. allows you to 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 bring the character, and yeah. to learn from each other, and that's a deep gift. That's amazing. Well, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of this film. Thank it was you. such an honor to talk to you. That's very kind of you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah.